Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Jessica the Dancing Avon Lady and today you're seeing me in PJs and barefaced. Now, why is that? It's because we're not focusing on makeup today. We are doing nails. These are a sheet of the 22 nail stickers that is kind of like exclusive just for the holidays. And uh, they come in two different styles. So they have this holly berry and then they also have this gorgeous white shade that's really, really beautiful. Um, I'm going to demo these ones today. Now I've used Avon nail stickers before in the past. Love them so much because they have these beautiful designs. So easy to use. Avon, if you're watching this, please bring more of these back because they were redonkulously awesome. What I'm going to do is I'm going to pretty much just kind of show you how to apply these and show you how they look at the end. When you open these up, you're going to see that they are absolutely stunning. They do have uh, different sizes, so you're going to want to kind of measure which one fits which finger the best, essentially. And then if the extra one, if you want to, you can always save it for if you're doing like a plain color on every nail and you just want to do one accent nail. Do what you will, do what you want. Do what you want, what you want with my nails now. Anyways, there is a little tear thing at the top to make it for easy access, easy open. But the first thing you want to do is you're going to want to really use some acetone and clean your nails to make sure you do get rid of any of that, you know, oily substance or any leftover cream and things on your nails. Now, I have not done my nails in eons since... I got pregnant with Nathaniel. I think I did my nails once. Yeah. I'm really bad about doing my nails, guys. You can see that I always have bare nails. I don't know what. I don't know what it is. I'm just really bad about doing my nails. That's why I'm so grateful for these. My nails are fairly short now. I just feel like it's easier, especially now we're still in the diapering phase. Long nails and poopy diapers, no buenos. So here we go. All right, let's first use the acetone and get rid of any gunk on the nails, shall we? So this video was requested by the one and only beautiful Pam. So thanks for re requesting this, Pam. So I'm just going to do a quick little cleaner roux on my nails. And then after that, the other thing that you're going to need is a nail file. So now if you have a relatively unsmooth surface, you're going to want to buff your nail bed to create a smooth surface. And of course, wipe each nail to remove oils. You can use nail scissors to trim the scissors, uh, to trim the stickers. Nail stickers should not be cold before applying. You can rub the stickers between your fingers and then you're going to want to file the uh, excess with a rougher grit. I have nail scissors. I think I think you'll probably do without nail scissors, but I'm going to grab nail scissors anyways. Be right back. I don't know. These are pretty, pretty poopy nail scissors, so we'll have to see whether or not they even work. We'll find out. So what we're going to do is these should not be cold, they said. So don't do these outside, I guess, in the car while you're waiting on a cold winter's day. I'm just going to warm up between my hands a little bit. My nails are relatively smooth. I don't have a lot of rough budget bumps or budges. Budges? But yes, budges. That's my new word of the day, guys. It's your word of the day from the Dancing Avon Lady. I think this is pretty much it. I mean, if you want, you can file down your nails a little bit to have a more gorgeous shape again I'm really bad at doing nails so it's gonna be how it's gonna be <laughs> all right so we're gonna start with the pinky one first wow there's so many extra I guess I could do one for my toe if I really wanted to <laughs> let's just get a show on the road you know what honestly this past year I've barely done anything with my nails because I don't go out oh, aren't these gorgeous oh my gosh they're so beautiful all right let's do that one all right so all we do there's another layer here we're going to take this, peel it off. Oh, nope, that's a good size. Thumbs up? Like that? I think so. It's a little fuzzy, I'm sorry, guys. Wait, I'm over here. There we go. So, you don't want it on the cuticle, you want it just about there. I'm gonna do it this way. Oh my goodness gracious, Jess. What is wrong with you? Okay. And then I'm going to press it down. There we go. Obviously, my nails are not that long. And then I'm going to I'm going to push it upwards this way. 
to smooth it out. Oh, 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 look at that. Oh, look at that. How pretty is that? And then I hope to God these scissors work. Let's find out. Yes, yes, they work, they work, they work. All right, and then I'll put that there. Fold this over. Okay, and then after you fold it over, I say to file the edges down with a rougher grit, which is what I'm doing now. Wow, so this little piece just kind of that I flung off came to the end of the tip. And look at how pretty is that? Oh, one's done already. I don't have to worry about it wrinkling. Look at that. You know, like how always like whenever after I do my nails, what happens is that I end up getting um, crisscrosses and marks and stuff from sleeping because I, I move so much when I sleep, even if I put top coats and everything. So look at that. Oh my God, it's so pretty. Ooh, sounds relatively painless once I figure out how to do it the first time. All right, let's do number two. Place it here, not on the cuticle, but right by the cuticle. Nope. Oh, I might have flubbed this one up a little bit. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh my goodness gracious, guys. There we go. There we go. Nope. Nope. Holy poop. The struggles are real. The other thing is, I think I grabbed the wrong size. All right, this one's gonna be so-so. We're gonna leave it as is. We're gonna leave this one as is. I think my fingers are thicker than I thought. <laughs> All right, I'll cut off the extra, fold it down, and then file. Now, the other thing that I also made sure that I did, guys, was to wash my hands with soap to get off any cream from my fingers too because I didn't want the um, the oils from my hand cream to uh, affect the stickers while I was grabbing them. Look at that! I can save the little one for Ginevra. Next! Oh, that was so easy. That was so easy! Now, you don't want to tug it. I'll make sure it comes off very easily. Look at that. <gasps> wow. That's so pretty. All right. So I'm only going one way downwards with the nails, um, with my file. I'm not going back and forth. Last one, thumb. These are fun, guys. It's also a lot cheaper than going to a nail salon. <laughs> Oh, that was so easy. Oddly, I think it's because it's such a light color. I find the these sparkly gold ones to be super easy to do. All right, and so in less than 10 minutes, my one hand is done, ready to go to bed. So I don't have to wait around forever. Look how pretty that is. All right, I'm going to go and do my second hand next. Look at the difference. I look so much more polished already. Ooh. So the first thing that I'm noticing already with the doing it on my non-dominant hand side, I'm having great difficulties trying to snip it. All right, I had to bring out the big guns. <laughs> so it's not really the difficulty of the task, it's more that my nail scissors are really crappy. So get a good pair of scissors, guys. I need to invest in a new pair, obviously. And... Oh my God, I love it so much. The other thing I forgot to mention is that it's actually easiest if you, t once you take it out of the package, press it against your nail to measure it to see if it's the right size. It's probably easier than trying to eyeball it. For this one, instead of going this way, I think I'm going to do it the upside down way. Because my nails are so short, you could barely see it on this side. I think, you know what, they're my nails. I'll do what I want. Yeah. Oh, I like that better. And because it also tapers in a little bit, it looks like on the one end, the other side was just a smidge too big. So I think this actually fits better on my nail. There! Done! Yay! This is my feet, not very ugly feet. But I was like, huh, I wonder if I could stick any of the extra ones 
on my like other toes, like the bits that I've cut off. And it does. I mean, it's not the most precise thing, but hey, who really looks at my feet anyways? Apparently now you guys. <laughs> I have like ugly dancer's feet, calluses and all that stuff. Anyways, it's an option if you want. It's not going to fit all of them, but I was just like, you know what? Let's just see where this goes. That's actually not bad. Huh. Wow, I really like this one. That's my favorite one out of all of them. That was really, really, really painless. I mean, I fumbled a little bit when I first started because I was like, oh, it's so out of practice. I don't really know what I'm doing. But all in all, look at that. Look how pretty that is. Ooh. Aww. Oh. I'm ready to go voguing now. You know, I, there's this like peacock dance in Chinese dance that we do. Oh, this would be such a pretty color for it. Yeah. Oh my God, these are so pretty. Aren't they gorgeous? And again, they were overall really easy to put on. Um, once I remember, it's like, oh yeah, I could bend it so that I can really see how it fits. You know what? I don't have to go to the salon. Now I do realize that this one doesn't fit perfectly. I don't know if it's an anomaly, but I have one hand that's slightly bigger. My dominant hand is thicker, I guess you could say, than my non-dominant hand, I guess because I work it so much more. So like the muscles are built up, flex those muscles just right, right. It's late. I am weird when it's late. And my chair is still creaking even though we sprayed it with WD-40. Ah, I am going to say that they will fit most people's one size fits most i'm not gonna say it's one size fits all you have super teeny tiny hands you might have a bit of difficulties or if you have broader hands it might also be a bit of difficulty or if you have super long nails again these might be a little bit difficult to do but for you know someone like me or someone who just wants a really quick mani at home that you can do without having to go to the nail salon. It's also really inexpensive. I mean, regular prices are $14 Canadian plus tax. Right now there is a promotion on that. I'm just hoping, hoping, hoping that Avon will keep this type of product, but bring in more colors because these are great for the holidays, but I would love to have a few more options um, so that I can do more with it because you know what if it's as easy as this and I know it's not going to smear off overnight and by the next morning I'm like oh my gosh my nails are so ugly then I would do my nails more I really really would I'm happy with these I'm really happy with these I feel more polished already uh, so that's it for this video guys thank you so much for watching I hope you enjoyed this video let me know in the comments below how often do you do your nails are you a duet at homer like me occasionally or regularly or do you have a pre-scheduled appointment with your nail salon every two weeks or so let me know in the comments below guys if you're interested in seeing this one and the other one make sure you do go to the description box below click that button so you can see everything that's available and if you have any questions about starting your own online Avon business make sure you do book me for a complimentary no obligation 15 minute consultation just to see if Avon is the right fit for you I am open to chat I'm open to help guys if you haven't yet and you want to come hang out again make sure you do hit that subscribe button as well as the little bell icon beside it so you never miss a video or notification I have new videos out every single week and you never want to miss one of those I love you guys see you next one bye Jay is gonna go nuts over these tomorrow She'd be like, Mommy, what did you do to your nails? You know, I could also like just do one on her. You know, okay, that's the other thing, guys. I would feel very happy doing this on my child because she doesn't have to smell all the nail polish fumes. That is something I'd be willing to do. These are so pretty. I wish I didn't use up all the glittery ones. I wish I saved the one glittery one for her. Yeah. That's it, guys. Good night.